Hey everyone, I'm Jeff Teagan, Raleigh, North Carolina. We're on location in Tennessee, and I've got all three crowns, XLE, Limited, and Platinum. Over the course of this video, I'm gonna show you all about the XLE, the Limited, and the Platinum, so you can do your research, and you know which one's best for you and your family. And our guest today, we've got the XLE in Oxygen White, the Limited, in heavy metal. And then we've got supersonic red and gloss black platinum. This is the bitone. This is like a musical group. I'm Jeff in the bitones. So let's compare the front ends first. All three vehicles have Toyota Safety Sense 3.0. This has a gloss black, front grille, silver metallic, lower bumper. It's got LED headlights and daytime running lights. They're gonna upgrade when we get to our friend Limited, this is a 5.8 inch, they all do, ground clearance. The Limited, what's special about our friend Limited? Well, it's got LED quad headlights, it's got front parking sensors. The grille itself is gonna be similar, I think it's about the same actually, as the XLE. And then this is the Platinum, and the thing about the Platinum is, the difference is gonna be in the performance, in the powertrain, in the all wheel drive, versus Limited and XLE. So it's still gonna have the quad LED headlights, front and rear parking sensors, rear cross traffic alert with braking, blind spot monitor. But look here, you can get the option of a bi-tone. That's a two-tone gloss black hood. The back will be pretty significant in the gloss black as well. So let's look here. Do you like the two-tone look of Platinum? Or are you thinking that Limited could be the way to go? or XLE. And while we're thinking about it, leave a comment. Oxygen white, heavy metal, supersonic red. And as we go up top, you'll notice that the XLE does not have a moonroof, but both the Limited and the Platinum have the panoramic fixed glass roof. So it's gonna appear a dark black there, shiny gloss black. You just have more contrast because this is the supersonic red. Are you getting any thoughts on the styling? Which one you prefer? When we're looking at the back, we're not gonna see all that many differences. They all have LED headlights, and that's a tribute to everything that you can get standard across the board on XLE and Limited and Platinum. This XLE here does not have parking sensors in the back. It does have the backup camera, and then you pop that, open it up, We've all got a trunk with 15.2 cubic feet of storage space, and you can pop those levers right there to lower the seats. They all come with a temporary spare tire right there. Now here we're gonna get a crazy contrast because this one does not have the bitone. The Limited doesn't, it's only the Crown, and that could be an option for you. You don't have to get the bitone in the Platinum. You can get one color. It's got parking sensors in the back. It's got this little washer right here. That's kind of cool. And then pop that as well. So let's keep going here. Right over here, this is the Hybrid Max. That's gonna be different versus the Limited and the XLE. Just a complete different look. What do you think about that? Do you like the all gloss black back end? It's got parking sensors. Nice. Shaboom. Right like that. Now here, let's take a look at the profiles. We've got XLE, we've got Limited, we've got Platinum. They're all here. The whole three ring circus. This is exciting. And by the way, let me put in a little clarifying asterisk here because these are all prototypes. They're pre-production models. So some things that you see in here could be changed. I don't know exactly what's the finished, finished production model and what's pre-production. So we gotta put that little disclaimer. Okay, we're out. And as we look across, what's cool is that most things are standard on the XLE, which is nice. That's really nice. This comes with 19 inch wheels. Here's what's interesting. Standard, 19 inch wheels, but the Limited can have either 19 or 21 inch wheels. These have been upgraded to the 21 inch wheels. Normally they would be 19 inch, but this has the advanced technology package, which gives you the panoramic view monitor, like 360 camera, the 21 inch wheels, and a digital key. So we'll look at the limited here. I'm gonna go back and tell you the profile features as well. 
Now this one right here with the bitone, you can really start to see the back end, the front end, and even on top, it just looks different than the other kids on the block. These are all new kids on the block. Step by step, oh baby. So here we go with the profile. We've got a 14.5 gallon fuel tank. MPG is not quite out yet, so I'm gonna wait to tell you that till the 25th, but it has cladding around here and here. They all have that gloss black accent that you see. They have auto unlock, auto lock, because they all have standard smart key. Holla, woo! They have power folding mirrors. LED turn signals, blind spot monitor, rear cross traffic alert too. Woo! So what do you think of the profile here? Again, it's got a lot of the same features as the XLE. Some appearances are all the same, but they all make a fantastic first impression. This has the power folding mirrors with LED turn signals, blind spot monitor, auto lock, auto unlock, yeah! Woo! We're going places, we're moving forward. Now take a look at these standard gloss black, Little metallic silver flash right there. Boom, 21 inches, baby. That's pretty cool. Do you like these wheels? Do you like the Limited? Do you like the XLE better? Both the Limited and the XLE have color keyed door handles. Take a look here. Take a look at me now. This is gloss black side mirror. It has chrome door handles. Nice, and gloss black too. All right, got the chrome trim. Which profile do you like better? Platinum, the Limited, or the XLE. Now this right here, I grouped two of them together, XLE and Limited, because they're different from the Platinum. The Platinum has more power, more performance. This is the fourth generation Toyota hybrid system. This right here is the Hybrid Max. Uh! These right here have the 2.5 liter dynamic force four cylinder engine with electric motor power. This produces 236 horsepower, 163 pound-feet of torque. It's matched with an electronically controlled continuous variable transmission, so the CVT. They have prop rod right there. They've got hood blankets. You can see the electric motor housing right here. We've got the four-cylinder right here. And then these ones have the on-demand all-wheel drive. So what that means is it operates like a front-wheel drive, the XLE and the Limited. So it's 100% of the torque distribution in the front, zero in the back, but you can change it up. If you get slippery conditions, things like that, the car can go all the way to a 20% front to 80% in the rear. Did you like that visual? Hybrid Max, pretty cool, right? Hybrid Max, let's get it right out there. 340 horsepower, 400 pound-feet of torque. Uh, this is 2.4 liter turbocharged inline four-cylinder engine. Uh, uh. Uh, that's pretty strong, right? It's matched with a six-speed direct shift, direct shift, six-speed automatic transmission. Full-time all-wheel drive. Runners on your mark, get set, go, and tell you what this is. This is torque distribution because it's full-time. It's always using some front, some rear. It goes from 70% front-wheel drive, 30% rear-wheel drive, but it can go all the way to 20% front to 80% rear. This one has, as opposed to the Limited and XLE that has three different drive modes, plus EV, this one has six different driving modes. Let's look inside the interior, and what we're gonna find is soft text and fabric seats. Every option you get for seating is very comfortable, like more than you think it's gonna have. This one has soft text around. It's available in just the black with the bronze accents, we'll call it. Here we go, but look, soft tech surround, and look at this, so plush, so comfortable, has power driver seat and power passenger seat. That's pretty strong stuff. Power mirrors, leather wrapped steering wheel. This is all standard because it's an XLE. Very cool here. We've got two USB C's, and then we've got USB A in there, also 12 volt circular. Look at this, matching, twinning, 12.3 inch screens. We've got this one right here, the multi-information display, 12.3 inches. Toyota Audio Multimedia, 12.3 inches. Wireless Apple CarPlay, wireless Android Auto. You can pair multiple cell phones at the same time. Fast processing speeds. It's got heated seat standard on it. Wireless, right there, that slot, wireless. Push button start, 
three different drive modes, electronic brake hold and parking brake. And then it's got the two USBs here. Let's take a look at the drive modes. Okay, we got eco, better gas mileage, normal, normal driving, sport acceleration. And then up top here, we've got the auto dimming rear view mirror, home link with garage door openers, LED lights, and sliders. Woo, there it is. So this right here is our friend XLE. Now let's take a look inside Limited. This is gonna be the first trim level where you see leather seats. And let me tell you, these are really comfortable. You can get black, black with brown, or the macadamia, which is like a light beige color. It's really beautiful, really opens up the vehicle. Some people like the black, some people like the light color. And on the Limited, I'm trying to show a little bit of everything here. This will be standard on the Limited and the XLE and the Platinum. Limited and Platinum are nearly identical on the inside. Rear USB-Cs, air vents, really chunky armrest. That's cool. That's really cool, you guys. But look here, we've got lights back there. This is where you get the fixed panoramic roof, like I was saying. We'll show that right now so we can open it up. I think it's right here. Yep. So it is fixed. It doesn't open, but it exposes light to everybody in the crown, whether you're front or back seat passengers. This has power driver seat, power passenger seat. So does XLE, so does Platinum. But look at these accents here. That's just really cool. Very nice here. We've got the de-icer function. Got all those safety features from Toyota Safety Sense 3.0 now. Same display right here. Look at this. We've got JBL sound system. I believe it's 11 speakers. So it has concert-like sound. Same auto dimming rear view mirror. I would have liked to have seen a digital rear view mirror here. I just like that feature. It's got home link. It's got the same lights and the slider. It's got all that jazz. It also has the same 12.3 inch multimedia touchscreen here. We can get information about our vehicle. Oh, that sounded terrible. Then we could go to music. Let's do some rock. I want to rock, rock. Dun, 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 dun. I want to rock. This one has standard heated seats and cooled seats. I thought that was that, but this is right here. Very cool, right? It's also got, look at this, heated steering wheel. Now, because this one has the advanced technology package, we're gonna have this button right here. That's for the panoramic view monitor. So you can see up top along the sides of. You can also, when you put it in reverse, see behind you just like that. So that might be a plus. I've gotten used to that in my Venza and I certainly would like that in my crown if I got one. Now this shows the torque distribution on this display. So you can see when it's using front wheels, when it's using the back wheels for more power in case you're in snow, like I said, or mud or sand, that kind of stuff. So let's look inside. Now this one's gonna be pretty much identical to our friend Limited. It's got the fixed roof. It's got the leather trim seats, heated seats, ventilated seats, memory seats, power folding mirrors. It's not, in case you were wondering, it's not a power adjustable. Let's look on inside. Ooh, fancy, fancy pants. It's still got the JBL sound system. It's gonna seem, again, almost identical to the Limited. It might be identical, as a matter of fact. Here we go. The difference between the Platinum and the Limited is mostly the performance, the handling, the all-wheel drive, certainly the power. 340 horsepower, 400 pound-feet of torque. This one's got more driving modes, though, so we got to check that one out. It still has the heated seats, ventilated seats. So here we go. Let's check the drive modes right here. We've got six of them. See if we can change this. We got, so this is different. We've got eco mode, comfort mode. Feels like a more plush, luxurious ride. I would use that one for sure. Normal, Sport S. If you want more performance, more throttle response, more cornering, go with the Sport S Plus. You can also do custom mode as well. So which one is best for you? And then here we've got the auto dimming rear view mirror with home link, the lights, the slider, all that jazz. It's all there. Thank you so much for watching. Do you prefer the XLE, the Limited, or the Platinum? 
ooh, this is gonna be a tough choice. I can't wait to see in your comment section, styling, features, technology, power, all wheel drive. Which one's better for you? Thank you so much. Please hit subscribe to join Toyota Jeff Reviews and then Instagram and TikTok, Toyota Jeff Reviews. Thanks everybody, peace.